Welcome to another episode of Timmy Talks, the channel where we talk old school magic. And we've got two envelopes today, um, a mail from Spain. And I think it has some Spanish white cards in here for my uh, weenie deck, because you saw me opening up some Thunder Spirits not too long ago, and uh, these are some extra additions. And I have this mystery pack, which I believe comes all the way from China. Um, and yeah, I've, I've got no idea what's in here. So I'm going to leave this for last. Maybe it's going to be another uh, extension cord like last time, you know, for my laptop. <laughs> if you if you missed that mail day, the link's popping up right now. Click on it. Watch it all the way to the end where I reveal what is in the mysterious package. You'll uh, probably laugh your ass off. But um, anyway, let's first open up this because I think I know what it is. Let's just put that post-it back because I don't want to... Uh, show you any you know address details this is a package from Spain and oh look at this um, interesting packing but well, that's good there we go okay 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 so we've got some uh, protection here a griffin it seems from a newer set yeah hey, there we go there we can already see the card so griffin fly out of here the other one fly out of here then we're gonna try to Hmm, take this off, but in a way that I don't wreck the cards. These cards, these uh, foreign cards that I got for my white weenie deck are actually in pretty bad shape, I think. But they were very affordable, which I think is really important. And uh, maybe it's nice to know, maybe you notice already, that there's quite a price difference between the foreign cards uh, when you look at prices in Europe and compare them with the prices in the States. Uh, okay, so here we've got one, but it's still hidden. But let's first check out this Armageddon. So this is Spanish. So one white and three, right, for the sorcery. I guess, or in this case, the, I, I can't pronounce this. Anyway, for the sorcery, that reads, destroy all lands. Tierra is land. And then we have another Armageddon and a new card. I still love the art. And of course, these cards are going to go in my white weenie deck uh, where you want to play out cheap creatures and then follow it up by an Armageddon. And obviously, I'm also playing with land decks in there. And here we can see the other Armageddon. So that's quite nice, right? I've got three of these. And I think I already have a fourth one, but I have to check. I mean, I've got, I've got so many cards here and I've got a box full of foreign cards, black bordered and white bordered. And I think there's one Armageddon in there, but I have to kind of go and, uh, and and dig through my collection. But I, I love doing that, you know, I, I love doing that, making new decks. So I'm just gonna put this one, these three cards, I should say, here. There we go. And then now for the package. I don't know what's in here. Is it gonna be another charger cable for my laptop? That is the big question. Ah, oh, this is tough, guys. Again, something that's tough to open. So I am going to use the scissors to open it up a little bit from the side. I know that some of you enjoy watching me struggle through these packages, so <laughs> but it is really tough. And the thing is, like, you don't want to damage anything. Okay, there we go. There we go, people. Opening it up. Oh, okay. This looks this looks special. What is this? Royal wax seal. Okay. Okay. Let's open it up. Oh, what the? That is cool. Is this the? What am I looking at here? So, taking these out, and I think I know what I can do with this. So, a royal wax seal. So, if I send a message, is this the logo of the channel? That would be insane. Is this the logo of the channel? What? That is ridiculous. So, okay, I'm just gonna use the scissors. I don't care, I just wanna show this to you. This is ridiculous. So this was sent to me by Mark, Marco actually, who is an Italian old school magic player. 
living in London. So hence, he's no longer Marco, but Mark when he's in London. And look at this, I've got this stamp and this is the logo. <laughs> this is the Timmy Talks logo. So, okay, so I need some candle wax, I guess. So I'm gonna try to arrange that. And then um, as soon as I've arranged it, I'm gonna show you how the stamp works. And then I also have these. Maybe is this to kind of take the wax out afterwards? Can somebody tell me what these are for? Or is this actually the candle wax? No, it's not, right? I am so I'm so green when it comes to these sort of things. I have no idea how it works, but I'm I'm going to look it up. And a royal wax seal. That is so cool. So I need wax, I assume. Put the stamp on and stamp it on an envelope, of course. This is super cool, Mark. Thank you so much. Maybe it's nice. I'm, I'm sure you guys know what the logo looks like, but just to give you a comparison. So this is the logo. This is a sticker. And here you see the logo on here on the stamp. That is fantastico. Thank you very much, man. I'm looking forward to uh, to start to look into how I can use this wax uh, stamp. That's just fantastic. And I'd like to, of course, thank you guys once again for watching another mail day video right here on Timmy Talks. This time we had a lot of Armageddon's in a wax stamp. See you guys next time. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Ik het dus, ik het dus, somber gezien.